O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. Christ the Lord is risen again. Christ hath broken every chain. Hark the angels shout for joy, singing evermore on high. Alleluia. He who gave for us his life, who for us endured the strife, is our Paschal Lamb today. We to sing for joy and say, Alleluia. He who bore all pain and loss, Comfortless upon the cross, Lives in glory now on high, Pleads for us and hears our cry. Alleluia. Now he bids us tell abroad How the lost may be restored, how the penitent forgiven, how we too may enter heaven. Alleluia. Do not let your heart be troubled. Only have faith in me. Alleluia. God alone is my soul at rest, my hell comes from him. He alone is my rock, my stronghold, my fortress I stand firm. How long will you all attack one man to break him down as though he were a tottering wall? or a tumbling fence. Their plan is only to destroy, they take pleasure in lies. With their mouth they utter blessing, but in their heart they curse. God alone me address my soul, for my hope comes from him. He alone is my rock, my stronghold, my fortress I stand firm. In God is my safety and glory, the rock of my strength. Take refuge in God, all you people, trust him at all times, pour out your hearts before him. For God is our refuge. Come and forget only a breath, grave in an illusion. Placed in the scales they rise, they weigh less than a breath. Do not put your trust in oppression, no vain hopes and plunder. Do not set your heart on riches, even when they increase. For God has said only one thing, only two do I know. That to God alone belongs power, and to you, Lord, love, and that you repay each man according to his deeds. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever. 
the God who is, who was, and is to come, at the end of the ages. Do not let your hearts be troubled. Only have faith in me. Alleluia. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let them rejoice in your saving help. Alleluia. O God, be gracious and bless us, and let your face shed its light upon us. So will your ways be known upon earth, and all nations and your saving help. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. Let the nations be glad and exult, for you rule the world with justice. With fairness you rule the peoples, you guide the nations on earth. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. The earth has yielded its fruit, for God our God has blessed us. May God still give us his blessing, to the ends of the earth revere him. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let them rejoice in your saving help. Alleluia. His majesty covers the heavens. The earth is filled with his praise. Alleluia. Let us give thanks to the Father who has qualified us to share in the inheritance of the saints in light. He has delivered us from the dominion of darkness and transferred us to the kingdom of his beloved Son in whom we have redemption, the forgiveness of sins. He is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of all creation, for in him all things were created, in heaven and on earth, visible and invisible. All things were created through him and for him. He is before all things, and in him all things hold together. He is the head of the body, the church. He is the beginning, the firstborn from the dead, that in everything he might be preeminent. For in him all the fullness of God was pleased to dwell, and through him to reconcile to himself all things, whether on earth or in heaven, making peace by the blood of his cross. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. His majesty covers the heavens. The earth is filled with his praise. Alleluia. Jesus, because he remains forever, can never lose his priesthood. It follows then that his power to save is utterly certain, since he is living forever to intercede for all who come to God through him. To suit us, the ideal high priest would have to be holy, innocent and uncontaminated, beyond the influence of sinners and raised up above the heavens one who would not need to offer sacrifices every day, as the other high priests do for their own sins and then for those of the people, because he has done this once and for all by offering himself.
The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. They saw the Lord. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Spirit will glorify me, since all he tells you will be taken from what is mine. Alleluia. My soul glorifies the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Saviour. He looks on his servant in a lowliness. Henceforth all ages will call me blessed. The Almighty works marvels for me. Holy is name. His mercy is from age to age on those who fear him. He puts for his arm in strength and scatters the proud-hearted. He casts the mighty from their thrones and raises the lowly. He fills the starving wicked things Sends the rich away empty. He protects his really servant, remembering his mercy. The mercy promised to our fathers, to Abraham and his sons forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit. Both now and forever, world without end. The Spirit will glorify me, since all he tells you will be taken from what is mine. Alleluia. In Christ who was raised from the dead, the Father has opened for us the way to eternal life. Let us pray to him. Save your people through the victory of Christ. God of, our, of God of our fathers, in the resurrection you glorified your Son. Grant us true repentance, that we may walk in newness of life. Save your people through the victory of Christ. You have brought us to Christ, the shepherd and guardian of our souls. Keep us faithful to him under the guidance of our pastors. Save your people through the victory of Christ. From the Jewish people, you chose Christ's first disciples. Show the children of Israel that your promises are fulfilled. Save your people through the victory of Christ. Remember the orphans the widows and the homeless of our world. Your Son has reconciled men with God. Do not abandon them now. Save your people through the victory of Christ. You called Stephen to yourself as he bore witness to Jesus. Welcome the faithful departed who have loved and desired you. Save your people through the victory of Christ. At the Saviour's command, and from by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. 
Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God and Father, we honour the yearly feast of your Son's resurrection by celebrating it in the sacramental mystery. Give us likewise the grace to rejoice with all the saints when he comes in glory, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life.